This drink I have in my hand work like magic. For people that are suffering from fibroid and ovarian cysts, please watch this video to the end. Hello guys, welcome back again to my YouTube channel. How are you guys doing? Hope you guys are keeping well. So guys, today's video, I'm making video on how to destroy or shrink fibroid. No matter how big that fibroid is, okay? Maybe you have suffered from this problem for many years and it, and it has prevented you from getting pregnant for your husband, okay? So if you are that woman in this category, I would like you to watch this video to the end. Use this remedy, okay? This remedy is also for women that are suffering from ovarian cysts, okay? I have used this remedy for both people that are suffering from fibroid and the ovarian cysts. And the, the testimony I am getting, the inbox, that is the message they are sending to me, is what motivated me to do this video. I am pleased, very much pleased with the message I am getting from these people, okay? Please follow the step I'm going to show you. By the grace of God, you are going to get your testimony through this video, okay? Please keep watching. The first thing I'm going to make use of is Negro Pepe. Negro Pepe helps to treat fibroid and ovarian cysts, okay? It can also be used to treat dry cough, fluid, and the cold. It contains anti-inflammatory properties, okay? And the new mothers can also use Negro Pepe for flat tummy. So I'm going to take some Negro Pepe, wash them, and add them in the pot. Please make sure that when, when you want to use your negro pepper, you add more, okay? This one I'm using now is just to show you how to prepare it, okay? The next thing I'm going to make use of is a uh, precase or adian fruit, okay? This one can destroy or shrink fibroid very quick, okay? So when you want to prepare this remedy, at least you will use up to two to three pieces of precase, okay? It's very, very good. It can shrink it very well, okay? So I will wash it and add it in the pot. Number three thing I'm going to make use of is fresh turmeric, okay? If you have powdered one, it's also good, okay? Turmeric disrupts fibroid cells and stop them from reproducing or regrowing again. It's also a killer for ovarian cysts, okay? So I'm going to wash this uh, turmeric. After washing it, I'm going to use my grater and grade it. After grading it, I'm going to add it in my pot, okay? Number 14 I'm going to make use of is black pepper. In Igbo language, it's called odor. Okay, black pepper contains abundant amount of antioxidants which help to shrink or destroy fibroid. It can also be used to treat ovarian cysts. Okay, so I'll be taking one tablespoon of black pepper, but if you are going to try this remedy, use two tablespoons. Okay, so I'm going to add it in the water, and after that, I will wash it and put it in the pot. Okay. Number 15 I'm going to use is ginger. Ginger helps naturally to shrink or destroy fibroid, okay? It's also good in, in treating ovarian cysts, okay? So if you're a woman and you are suffering from fibroid or ovarian cysts, I would advise you to incorporate ginger in your daily meal, okay? So even if you want to use ginger, please use big quantity, not this small one you are seeing here. This one is just an example, okay? So after peeling the ginger, I'm going to wash it off camera, grade it and add it in the pot. The next thing I'm going to add now is oregano. This is one of the best spices people use in cooking, but they don't know that this spice work wonders when it comes to shrinking fibroid, okay? Oregano contains chemicals that help to destroy or shrink fibroid and the ovarian cysts. It also helps to fight against bacteria or virus, okay? So I'll be taking one tea tablespoon of oregano and they add it inside the pot. Keep watching.
So after I've added everything in the pot, the next thing now, I'll be adding two cups of water. And after that, I'm going to transfer it in the fire and boil it for 15 minutes, okay? Please make sure you cook it in a big quantity, okay? So that after you finish drinking this one, you put the rest in your fridge. And the, anytime you want to drink it, only just bring it out, warm it and drink it, okay? So after 15 minutes, I'll off my gas and allow it to cool. The next thing, I'm going to take my drinking cup and my sieve. I will sieve out some. Please keep watching because I'm going to show you how to drink this remedy. Okay. This is how you are going to drink this remedy. Okay. Drink this remedy one cup in the morning. You stay 30 minutes before you take your breakfast. Okay. And drink it one cup again before you go to bed. Okay. And drink it straight for three weeks and after three weeks my sister go back to the hospital let doctor run a check on you again you are going to testify okay okay guys thank you very much for watching for i have come to end of today's video i hope you like this video please don't forget to subscribe to this channel follow me on my facebook page instagram and also give me a thumbs up share this video and comment see you again in my next video Bye-bye. Ciao.